It's not uncommon to hear comparisons made between the Marshall Aid Plan at the end of the after the end of the Second World War and the Belt and Road Initiative, and I think this is understandable um, because they were both extremely ambitious. In the American case, it was to transform Europe at the end of the Second World War after the destruction of the previous years, and in the Chinese case, it is to transform the Eurasian uh, landmass. But I think that beyond that, the similarities are not so strong. I mean, martial aid was, first of all, on a much smaller scale. At today's prices, I would guess, martial aid was about one-twelfth of the size of the Belt and Road Initiative. The other great difference, actually, was the purpose. The purpose of martial aid was to transform Europe at the end of the Second World War, and that was really seen as part of the reviving of the West at the beginning of the Cold War. Now, Belt and Road is something completely different. Belt and Road is aimed at, of course, the largest landmass in the world, the Eurasian landmass, which is overwhelmingly populated by people in developing countries, many of whom are quite poor. And so the purpose of Belt and Road really is the transformation of the conditions of a large slice of humanity who live still even today in very poor conditions. So the geopolitical nature of the two projects is very different. Martial aid, the beginning of the Cold War, Belt and Road Initiative, the transformation of the developing world.